guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes 3 and 4 of Symphony GX. Let's go ahead and get started with episode 3 and 3, 2, 1, go. Mm So you gonna tell me it's gonna maybe what take a couple of episodes for them to transform again? I I mean, yeah, they ain't noise, so what the fuck are these things? <laughs> Still got a lot of questions about the girl, but you know, hopefully we'll get that answered and then this not these, but the the sword. I I got questions on that, you know. I mean when I saw that sword last week, I was like, okay, throw everything out from what I just said, and something about a sword. <laughs> but, I don't know. Yeah, and see, that's the biggest thing I want to know, especially with those three. How are they going to play a significance in this season if they can't transform? What the fuck can you do? We only got three Sinfoker users. Technically, now we only got one. And that's CB key. So, what can you do, ma'am? That's what I don't know. I mean, it's indicating from the opening that, yes, they're going to get their stuff back. But the biggest thing is when, where, why, how. There you go. That's all I need. Mm-hmm. I still can't believe this season's dealing with alchemy because, like, that was something that I wasn't really expecting. But, you know, hey, it's an interesting thing to put in this show. But, I, I mean, okay. Uh <laughs> Can't go get your girlfriend. Yeah, so they're supposed to be OP as fuck. Well, I mean. She's a doll. Especially like, did you see her feet? Like, ah. I mean, you don't want to put anything on Chris to cover her. I'm just saying, but okay. But there's gonna be a point where there it's gonna stop for them. There has to be. Because I don't know. We'll see.
Yeah, you don't want to get too close to them. Right, but... I don't know, because, like, Kitty, I mean, she has the potential to stop. <laughs> See, at least somebody grabbed and covered Chris. Thank you. Like, I mean, damn. Yeah, but, um, Hibiki, Hibiki, Hibiki. So then you were just tools. What kind of a Not you, my mother. Yeah, because we, we need to address the problem. Uh, I get that. So is there a way to fix it though? Yeah, but see, nobody asking about goddamn Kiwi Hello? There we go! Oh my god! <laughs> It's 
seriously. Yeah, I mean, because, come on. Maria can still do something. Don't know why, but she can do something. Really, you just gonna make me hungry now? I haven't eaten yet. It's 6.28 at night, and I haven't eaten dinner yet, and I'm hungry now. <laughs> Honestly, just like the onions and the tomato, I don't know why, but that looks really good by itself. Yeah, y'all just made me fucking hungry. And I'm not going to be able to eat until I watch the next episode. You better be grateful your wife is taking care of you. Like, oh my god. <laughs> no. Is that avocado? Yeah! Mm. I'm just hungry. That's so true. <laughs> but. See, okay, I got this weird thing. Little theory on Tabasa. I feel like once all of this is over, she's gonna still continually wanting to be an idol. I don't know, maybe. It's just up to her. I bet she's a girl who worries about so many different things. She thinks about, she's multitasking. And girl. She smiles when she sees her girlfriend stop. <laughs> Honestly, no, you can't say that. Yeah, how can you fix it, by the way? Yeah. No, you guys are somewhat out of commission for now. You can only go so far. Besides, we don't really need any of you dying, right? Yeah. But then what the hell? 
ながら返すし、バーサからだよ。Um, yeah, you're all dolls. The way they're all posed, like if you've seen a traditional like music box with like a figure inside, like, that's what they're giving me. But you you on the side of good, right? I mean. So you're a doll too, but you look human. That thing? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs>
of course. Let's see. Yeah. God. He became the only one to help me so fucking easily. This what happened. Oh my god. God, she gives me the creeps. They all do. See, there it goes. Let's talk it out, Hibiki. Like, oh my, <laughs> my baby, she's so precious. <laughs> no matter how many seasons we are currently into this show, she's the type of child who's just like, yes, let's talk it out. <laughs> Oh my god, are you serious? My god, are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck? Is it because Chris is Tsubasa? Is it that? Like, mm-mm, 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 no. No, I can't accept that. Mm -mm. No. 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 What the fuck is going on? No. (laughs) Excuse me. Hello, are you fucking kidding me? Like, no, give an episode three like that. No, 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 no. Okay, so, all right, I got a couple of questions, especially on Ella. And so wondering, like, possibly are her and Carol related? That's what I'm still thinking. We need to hopefully get that answer soon. But you're telling me that that little small piece can do something like that. I, I was thinking that, like, it wasn't going to work until officially you assemble the whole sword, and then that's when it would possibly work. Who knows? This is only episode three. But, um, yeah. Uh-huh. And I'm gonna say, um, Carol's group of misfits. What the fuck? They all creepy as hell. I mean, I, I like the aesthetic. I do. I think they're interesting characters, but I mean, as someone who also likes creepy things, like, I, I can still get creeped out by some creepy things, and that was creepy as fuck. Um, it seems like the last one who just woken up, she seems the creepiest, and as I said again, I can, I'm can. i literally always comparing her to the girl in the, like, somewhat final season of Alia. If you've seen Alia, you probably know who I'm talking about. I'm talking about the other red-haired girl who was in love with that one dude, and yeah, yeah, yeah her. She was fucked up. <laughs> like, oh my god. But honestly, I didn't think they would have necessarily talked about um l sex i i thought it was a little interesting thing i i would to me it seemed a little it seems important because i think something's gonna come up later on about it but i think the way it just came up it seemed like it was a little unimportant or not needed it was just something that they're saying like oh hey Let's just put this little information out here. It's not needed now, but sometime later on at the end of this show, by the time I finish season three, there's possibly going to be something that comes up. I'm not 100% sure. I still want them to go into both Elf and Carol's backstory because, hold on, Cody, I'm almost done. Um, I have a lot of questions specifically on the, the situation between Carol and Hibiki from last week with the dad situation and what that could possibly mean because as she said she did see her dad die in front of her and I want them to go into the backstory like that how they did with Maria and her sister in season two and so I mean I I feel like I I don't think my answers are gonna get my answers my questions will be answered like ASAP but um yeah we'll see Go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode four. Okay, episode four in three, two, one, go. Hmm. 
Come here. That's why you were crying because you wanted to come in here. Hmm? See, I feel like in this episode she's gonna maybe transform. I'm not 100% sure. Come here, baby. Um, it just really depends on how it goes, but who knows? I mean, I, I don't want Kibi, Shibabe, and Maria to not, but I don't think they are, because like from what I've asked um, at the end of season two, they're, they're going to be able to transform fully. Maria, I'm hopefully hoping, I mean, because since she has her sister to carry who knows? We just gotta wait and see. But, um... Hibiki. Help her, please. Because Hibiki can't sing now. And I'm just like... What's she gonna do? What can you do, honey? I mean... Yeah, he be cheap. He be cheap. Nope, cause he be cheap. It's just he be cheap, but he be cheap has her own predicament. I mean, I don't think it, like, you know, Miku, you want to do something, honey? I mean, we're going to do something like, you know, healing good for you, Miku, just take the and she transforms, please. First, Maria's gonna go. Fuck it. Um...
but it's complicated. You <laughs> gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> Hello, wait, 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 stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Why is it okay? For a moment, one moment, I thought it wasn't going to work for her, but okay. Yeah, but you have limitations. Damn. Yeah, I mean, we go question that. I got a lot of fucking questions about that thing. You telling me it was that easy? Okay. Oh, fuck. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, um, okay. <laughs> so, okay, you know, you know what the fuck I'm going to ask. Why the fuck can Maria use? He be his gear. Wouldn't it be like, because I'm assuming that he be he, and I've been assuming this ever since season one, that he be he would have been able to use like anyone else's gear. Because that was the biggest thing that I was waiting for. And I was like, oh shoot, like they might do it, but they did it with Maria, so I'm okay. Yeah, and honestly, can we wipe that blood off? And you look a little scary with that on, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. No, you're okay.
maybe that's the reason why she was she couldn't sing because she hesitated basically. Um, are, are we sure we want Mika to go out? Because I'm kind of afraid if she goes out, she's going to be a little terrified of some of these bitches. So, um, whatever floats your boat. So See, it makes me wonder in the game that'll be out in like what two days from now, but by the time this comes up, you'd already be out. Um, are they gonna have in the gotcha where she's gonna go back and wearing like black and white? Um, is homework keyword for depressed? Possibly. Yeah, but I feel like Nika, she gonna come and let her own this officer. She gonna do something. Mm hmm.
Hey, Vicky. What do you mean you don't know? I mean, well, yeah, but you were, you were trying to save someone. Is it close to Hebe? Yeah. Okay, so we got what? Less than like mm, seven minutes. In seven minutes, if she don't get this gear and transform, we're going to have a problem. We already got a problem now, but like, come on. Because we know he he wants to protect people, but I mean, you're with your girlfriend, your wife. So, you know, I mean, so I need to come out. Mm. Can you not know? Damn it, he be he. Your girlfriend, oh my god. See, it's always do it for your girlfriend. You're giving me, you're blaming whoever. She did the gold girl. Oh my god. <laughs> you're just saying I love you and I Why did I honestly think she was going to kill her right then and there? Like, oh my god.
What are you serious? Bitch. No, oh my god. to do this? What the fuck did I do to deserve this? I didn't do nothing wrong. He just, just I thought I was gonna be fine. It's so mean. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? How? Mm. I don't know how to feel about that. I mean, Jesus Christ. Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck will happen now? He's out of commission right now. She knocked the fuck out. Her soul just went like, oh, I mean, this girl is like, mm -mm. She there, but she got she like Kibito. She keeps <laughs> all in this bitch. Like she's still there in her mind. The eyes but like ah Miku can't do anything, can she? I mean, oh my god, no, he's Miku ain't got no gear. I honestly really thought what they possibly could have done for Miku after season two. But like, yeah, let's give Miku a gear officially, you know, not being a bad guy, I'm a good guy, but What the fuck is going to happen now, though? How can we be so sure this is gonna work, though? We ain't gonna know. I'm not gonna know until next week. Oh my god. I mean, okay, hold on. Are they gonna do... Okay, you know how, like, in season one, in the first episode, when he he has, like, pieces of, um, yeah, the Kanade thing and, and it's like that? Are they gonna put, like, pieces of the gear inside Chris's bus and we're gonna do surgery and everything? I don't really know. Um. <laughs> this is why Miku, at the end of season two, should have got a goddamn gear. They're gonna give her a necklace and everything. Like, here, Miku, like, just in case Hibiki, something happens to Hibiki between season three to season five to the end of this damn show. Like, just in case. Like, we don't know. I mean, because it would have been smart. Fucking smart. But then you're like, you're just like, no, no, it's okay. It's okay. You know, it's fine. Sir. <laughs> Ma'am, please, like, oh my god, like, my child is, uh, she got a commission, what what else can he think he do, she, she is Kirito, in a nutshell, this is freaking Sora online, oh my god, like, she can't do anything, cause she's knocked out, like, what the fuck, what can you do, I'm so scared now, because it's just Miku, and then, hopefully they can get this done in time, because like, oh my god, mm-mm, Mm -mm. Can Chris and Tsubasa, like, get their ASAP? Who fucking knows? Like, oh my god. And the fact is that you leave it like that. And then... I can't. Oh, I fucking can't. Oh my god. Just... I, I, that little hope that I had for EBP, I was like, okay, you got this, you got this, you got this, babe. Like, 
oh my god, you're gonna be able to feed her, you're gonna be able to go home with your wife, and then lay down with your wife, and go to sleep with your wife, and you, 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 you took it, and you, you just was like, yeah, no, that's not gonna happen today, like, mm-mm, he be he is just gonna, mm. That's exactly what it was. It just took my heart and you just ripped it apart. I mean, shit. Like, how that? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? And the fact is that I gotta wait until maybe Thursday or Friday? I don't know. It just depends on, like, my schedule and stuff. To watch the next damn episode. I mean, I, I would say fuck it. I would watch the, the next two episodes now, but I gotta do something. For the rest of the night. <laughs> what the fuck was that ending? I, I mean, okay, you know what I said, like, in the last season where I was like, oh, I don't think there's gonna be, st like, an ending that's gonna trump this one. Yeah, um, the first four episodes of this season have literally just trumped that. And then whatever else happens in the rest of this season, I mean, oh my god. It, it just, I, I don't... I, I don't know what else to expect with this show anymore. I feel like, you know, one, <laughs> I feel like one time I had like a weird theory about it. I mean, we're four episodes in and I'm thinking it's going to go this way. And then it completely goes a completely different route. And I'm like, what the fuck? I mean, the, the, the alchemy and everything. I, I still love this show. 10 out of 10 will recommend. But like, what the fuck? How can you go against something as alchemy and then I, I don't know I really don't I mean dead ass like thinking about it because alchemy is another level for these girls and especially with the end of episode two where you know their gears were destroyed and everything and I was sitting here thinking like um what the hell can y'all do now? And since we're kind of getting something with Project Ignite, but we're not going to see that till next week, and I kind of wish that... And see, no, this is... Okay, yeah, going back to the kind of wish thing. I kind of wish that what they would have did with this episode is to give a little more explanation on what exactly it is, but I guess we're going to get to see that in the next two episodes. Because it is something that's going to have to deal with both Chris and Tsubasa, and of course, I ain't going to see it until next week. What I'm kind of hoping is, like I said, since the game is coming out, I believe today's the 11th, I think it comes out tomorrow night? Um, let me check. I'm not 100% sure. But I think it does come out tomorrow night. Uh, the biggest thing I was wondering is no the 15th so it'll be out this weekend um biggest thing i was wondering but then it's says practice so either tomorrow or this weekend i don't know biggest thing i'm wondering is when i play the game because of course i am going to play the fucking game i uh, i'm wondering if like should i <laughs> should i even play the game because i feel like i'm going to get spoiled on some things i, I don't know how far you know along into the story they're gonna go i mean because of the fact is i don't know how long it's been in japan for and how ahead they are in that story and because we're just now getting this game this week and usually typically with gotcha games especially if i can use like maybe love live or um love live or bendity or even review starlight even though i don't play that anymore um they're usually like at least maybe Six months. Where uh, I know Ian is usually six months uh, behind JP and stuff, but I feel like possibly what they're gonna do with the game because Ruby Starlight game did this. They like literally um, made everything come out like ASAP, like quick, 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 just to get caught up with the JP server. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I might be the type where it's like until maybe I finish the story. I mean, well, the anime completely as a whole. I might just do like. Um, event stories, like the Attack on Titan event that's coming out soon, and then once I finish all five seasons uh, plus the specials and stuff, that's probably when I'll deep dive into the main story. Who knows? I mean, I ain't gonna know until possibly tomorrow or this weekend, but yeah. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Beatrice episodes 3 and 4 of Simple Gear GX. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially out next Friday for Patreons and next Thursday for everybody else for episodes 5 and 6. Bye, guys!